Hey guys, it's Bodie with IPTVWire.com. In this quick video, I'm going to show you a simple VPN speed trick that you can use to improve the streaming speeds on your Fire Stick or streaming device instantly. Now, in this example, I'm using Surfshark VPN, which does allow for VPN split tunneling, Analyty speed test so I can do a before and after speed test and also Tubi TV as an example streaming application that does work with Surfshark VPN. So the very first thing I want to do in this video is make sure that I am connected to Surfshark VPN. And guys, if you are in the market for a VPN, I do have a special discount link for Surfshark below this video that will get you the best discount and also help support myself and this channel. Now, Surfshark is my top ranked VPN for very Various reasons and speed being one of them. So after I'm connected to Surfshark, the next thing I want to do is run a speed test on Analyty speed test to see what types of speeds I am getting on my Fire Stick with Surfshark VPN enabled. So I'm going to come back here in a few seconds after my speeds are successfully pinged. All right, so as you'll see, my speeds here with Surfshark VPN connected are 111 megabits down and 104 megabits per second up. Now, I must say before going on to the next step that these are very good download speeds and I can stream 4K and 1080p content very seamlessly. So this is really cool to see that Surfshark gets good speeds like this already. So now the VPN speed trick that I want to show you is called split tunneling. So if I launch Surfshark here, for example, and I scroll over and click the features option here. If you scroll down, you'll see something here that says bypasser. Select specific apps to route via or bypass the VPN. More particular, bypass VPN. So this is another term for VPN split tunneling. And this just simply allows you to bypass your VPN connection for selected applications. So when you enable split tunneling through Surfshark VPN, First of all, it's gonna make you reconnect. So I'm just gonna click reconnect, but you're basically telling the application to ignore VPN and route traffic through your internet service provider instead of the VPN server. And this will increase your speeds when using streaming applications. So once I enable bypass VPN, you can click this option here that says zero apps selected. Now there are a lot of built-in system apps. So instead of scrolling down, I like how they have this search feature here. So I'm gonna click search and then I'm going to type in Tubi as that is the application that I want to bypass with Surfshark VPN to get better speeds. So if I click Tubi here and I come down and click next, you'll see Tubi right here. So I'm going to check mark this and it says added to the bypass list. So if I go back, I'm going to click cancel. Uh, I'm going to X out of Tubi here, click clear, click next go back to features and you'll see here one app selected. If I click that, you'll see Tubi is check marked right here. Um, so now that this is enabled, you would simply just launch Tubi and you would enjoy better streaming speeds and an overall better streaming experience. Now that that traffic is not being routed through the VPN and it's going through your generic ISP or internet service provider connection with no VPN in the middle to slow down your speeds. Now Tubi, I'm not gonna go through in this video, but they have thousands of free movies and TV shows and also live channels. I've made several other videos about Tubi, um, but this is just a great little trick here that you can use to get better speeds on streaming apps like Tubi. So that's it guys. That is just a quick little VPN speed trick that you can use to get overall better speeds when using streaming applications like Tubi. Again, this is Bodie with IPTV Wire. Appreciate you all watching this video. Be sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Like this video. Also leave me a comment below. If you guys know any other speed tricks or just anything with a VPN that you want me to cover in future videos, I do appreciate all of you who leave comments. Again, this is Bodie, guys, and I hope you all have a great day.